welcome back. I am barefaced because I'm just gonna do some swatches today. Uh, Lock Maiden, hey girl, asked me to compare my dupe of the Natasha Denona Yucca palette to the Nomad Cosmetics Okavango Safari palette that just came out a couple days ago. Oh no, 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 I'm sorry. It's coming out today for the public. Uh, so here is the Okavango Safari palette. And then here is my dupe of the Natasha Denona Yucca palette. So let's put those two together. Now what I'm going to do, I'm first just going to swatch everything. I'll swatch the uh, dupe palette here. And then I'll swatch the Okavango next to it. And then what I'll do is I will either use the other arm or I'll wipe them off. And I will try to match similar shades to each other. I hope that makes sense. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get started. Here we go. You might be wondering why there's a black box right there. And that's because my boob was hanging out. And since it isn't that kind of show, yeah, I had to cover it up. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
is where we switch to me trying to match shades from the Okavango Safari palette from Nomad with the dupe palette of the Yucca palette from Natasha Denona. palette and then here are corresponding shades with the Nomad Safari palette. Now I think there are some that are pretty spot on like this one here, this one, this one, this one, this one, um, maybe this one, uh, and maybe this one. So what I had to do though, is I did have to use some of the Safari, or I'm sorry, yes, some of the Safari shades more than once. So there aren't any like direct to direct uh, shades one by one from the palettes, but I think that I tried, like I tried to get as close as I possibly could, and I did have to use some of the shades more than once. So, like I used this shade twice, I used this shade twice, I used this shade twice. Um, I think that's it. Now, I think that if you want more of the like green base, then the Yucca palette's gonna be a good idea for you because the shades are all pretty, like have an undertone of green. The Nomad palette, I think, has that green undertone, but also just some 
other kind of shades. And what I noticed with the Nomad palette is that the shades are a little bit deeper. So if you can see this shade right here, from the duped Natasha Denona. This shade, the only like real corresponding one, that one is deeper. Uh, this shade here, this one is a little bit deeper in the Nomad palette. This shade here, this one just has a different undertone, I would say. This shade here, those are kind of pretty spot on. This one here and this one is a little bit deeper. Uh, this one, this is a little bit deeper. Uh, this one, I think the difference is like this is has more grain to it. This has like more of a grayish brown, I would say. Um, and I think this shade here is rosier than that one. So there you go. Like if you just bought the Nomad palette, don't think you're gonna need the Yucca palette. If you don't have the Nomad palette, then maybe you know, try for this one. Now, these are dupes, like I said, so I'm not going to get the palette. And seeing that I can get similar looks with the Nomad one, but it has deeper shades, I think that is going to be good and kind of makes me think, nah, I don't need the Yucca palette. Another few palettes that might be similar are the Colored Rain Safari Rain palette, and they just actually brought that back. I think it's been a year since it was, like not sold on their website and the Juvia's Place Tribe palette. Now I actually used to have both of those and I decluttered both of those quite a while ago. So that also kind of further confirms for me that I don't need to get the Yucca palette because when I have had like kind of like spot on dupes, I have gotten rid of them. So hopefully this was somewhat helpful. This was just like a quick swatch party. Um, I'm trying to think. The only other palette I have that might be one that's similar to the Yucca palette is maybe the Melt uh, Gemini palette. Maybe. And um, I'm trying to think of what I have. I think the mattes will probably be in the old Natasha Denona Safari palette that kind of everyone hated. Uh, but I think that's it. So I'm sorry I don't have any other ones that I can like compare, but I think I've done pretty good so far with 15 dupes and then finding shades in the Nomad palette to go along with it. So let me know what you think. Let me know which one you're kind of drawn to and I don't think I'm gonna get it, guys. Like, I keep going back and forth because people are like, oh my god, I love it! But I think I'm just gonna leave this one alone because it is pretty dupable for me, at least, and they're also not a ton of shades that I wear regularly, so I think I can get away with not having the Yucca palette. Let me know what you think. Um, let me know if you're picking it up. Let me know if you're gonna try to dupe it instead. Thank you for coming along on this ride with me. I hope this was helpful. I also hope that you are continuing to take care of yourself. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.